What's up guys, just got my new part. It's the Asus CD DVD burner. God, there's no like in between is there with this room. It's like either, there we go. <laughs> CD, uh, it's a DVD burner. It's non-Blu-ray, but uh, 20 bucks, very cheap. So I went ahead and bought a 120 millimeter fan as well. Which uh, with this case, let me turn it on. <clears throat> this case actually came with an air duct for my uh, I think I like it better. Right? This case came with a an air duct. It's a shroud, basically. Uh, it cools off my GPU since I have a super clocked EVGA. EVGAs are known for running uh, hot, so as it is, at least the, I don't know about the 580s. I know the 570s do. And um, so I have a super clocked one, which means it will run even hotter, which I don't like. So I got this 120 millimeter fan goes right in this little air duct so here's the computer you know it used to be like that I put this trash just like plastic you know it's just kind of there and then inside you mount you can see the red LEDs very very little it doesn't matter though because you can't see the fan so it is maybe there yeah, that's better maybe you can kind of see it if I pull all these hard drive chate trays out see little fan I put in there it just blows air even faster into this and I am planning like later on like we're talking months later I'd like to get a second EVGA GTX 570 which will run even better but uh, yeah I definitely want to keep this sucker cool because I hear that uh, a lot of people are having problems with the I think they call it the VRAM that's heating up in these that's what I've read on forums and stuff so and uh, you know one more piece guys I got the hard drive that's left but right in here, I don't know why I took all these trays out. Demonstration. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I'm pretty pumped, not gonna lie. I sold this thing on eBay and uh, this guy didn't pay me yet, which will be enough money to finish this thing off. So, whenever that asshole decides to pay, I'll be able to finish it. So uh, yeah, this computer is sexy looking. It is awesome. I was hoping that LED in there would have been brighter, but... It's really not a big deal, you know. The fan was only like nine bucks, so it moves air though. Like holy shit! I'm sure, if you guys can hear that. <laughs> but yeah, it moves air. So one more piece, and we're done. The disc tray works fine. Just gotta push the button, and it opens up nice and fast. And you push it in, and it closes nice and fast. So yeah, that's about it. Thank you all for watching, and uh, yeah, like four or five more days and I'll have the hard drive up, and then I'll probably buy Windows 7 anyways, even if the boot disks don't work. The boot disks are meant for a Dell laptop, I doubt. I just have a feeling it won't work with a brand new computer. I'm going to try it, but I don't think it'll work. Um, Windows 7 is 85 bucks. It's on sale right now, so I'm going to go ahead and buy that, and... Um, yeah, then I could start. I don't even think I need these CDs. I just have to go online and download the drivers so yeah any questions you guys have about the system or your own build or anything like that um, I'm not going to be able to say I can give out tips but I could give out experiences I had building mine and uh, when this thing's up and running and running games at a de decent frame rate you know then uh, my mission is complete and I am so happy that with this build I mean it's so cool. Alright, well, thank you all for watching. Ow, shit, I bashed my head off my freaking TV. <clears throat> Peace out.